Hi, this is Chiranjeevi. This question appeared in December 19, 2016, CSIR net. The question is, correct match for the products of the reactions in column A with the properties in column B is, so we have two columns, column A and column B, and in the first one, so cyclotetraene plus 2K, so gives some product, and uh, it belongs to which property? Okay, and second one is cyclotetraene reacting with H2SO4, and third one, so this bicyclic compound on heating, and fourth one is so tetracyclic compound and reacting with two moles of potassium. Okay, so these reactions involves uh, these properties. So we should match the correct properties with these reactions. Okay, we have the four options. So these are the, these are the four options. So now we are going to check the properties by which these reactions can occur. Okay. So cyclo tetra in. Okay, this on reacting with two moles of potassium. Okay, right. So we know that. Potassium loses its electron in its solution. So, 2 moles of potassium gives 2 electrons. Right? So, when this potassium reacting with cyclotetraene and it donates its electrons to this cyclotetraene, okay, but initially this cyclotetraene so doesn't be planar like structure so to relieve strain it occupies pucker structure like this okay or Okay, so then, and it is eight electronic system. Okay, eight electronic system, right? And it it, it uh, doesn't be in planar structure, planar planarity, but it is in pucker pucker structure. That means it it uh, uh, to relieve its a uh, strain, it occupies boat like structure. Okay. Right, and when this cyclotetraene reacts with potassium, so it donates two electrons to this tetraene, and there is a possibility to form two electrons, extra two electrons. Now it is 10 electronic system. Okay electronic 10 electronic system right and these two extra two electrons to delocalize throughout this molecule okay so this cyclotetraene must be in planar structure then only these two electrons uh, moves throughout the molecule okay so that means this uh, cyclotetraene and by obtaining two electrons from potassium it occupies planar structure then only the extra two electrons delocalize throughout the molecule and it should it should get stability hence according to Huckel's aromaticity okay Huckel's aromaticity and the molecule should be planar and it should uh, obey 4n plus 2 pi electronic systems. Okay, now this this uh, molecule, okay, it, it is planar, planar in structure and it obeys 4n plus 2 electronic, electronic system because it, it contains 10 electrons. We know that according to Huckel's 4n plus 2 system, if the system contains 10 electrons, it is aromatic in nature. Hence, this product is has aromaticity 
or it is simply it is aromatic compound okay right next second one this is first one and if you observe second one so it is on reacting with h2so4 what happens so we know that 2h++ so4 minus 2 when this sulfuric acid reacting reacting with this cyclotetraene for example it goes on it and it abstracts 1h plus okay so from that we can write here is H and here is the positive charge and it, it reacts with sulfate so HS for 4 okay HS for 4 and it, re it reacts with it and from this we get this structure okay so in this compound so I'm, I'm representing here only so it has only six electrons six pi electrons okay to get this uh, to get stability so to delocalize the six pi electrons so we have we have here sp3 carbons so there is no possibility to delocalize the six uh, uh, pi electrons hence this molecule occupy or gets homo aromaticity like this Okay, so these six pi electrons can delocalize. So this sp2 carbons, sp3 carbons occupy above the plane of this molecule. Okay, so this kind of aromaticity, aromaticity is simply called as homo aromatic. Okay. So second one is aroma homo aromatic and next next third one okay in this molecule bicyclic compound on heating okay so here is the on heating so the cleavage of this bond takes place okay so this is 4n system okay so the cleavage of bond takes place here so this is 4n pyotronic system 4n pi electronic system so 4n pi electronic system on thermal condition con rotation through the con rotation so the cleavage of bond takes place here or opening of this bond is uh, takes place okay right so what is con rotation same uh, same side of uh, opening of this molecule okay so same side of the molecule means so you can so so same side opening okay all right all right okay so now this is non planar 
okay non planar and uh, sorry so here is taking place of two double bonds and uh, it has eight electrons okay so four pi electron means it has eight pi electronic system and it is non planar okay so whenever the molecule um, the delocalized molecule fire fire electrons containing molecule is non planar that is simply non aromatic next fourth option on reacting with two moles of potassium okay so it gives two electrons to this system right so the five electron five electronic delocalized system potassium gives two two moles of potassium giving two electrons to it and it it has one two three four five six seven seven means 14 electronic system okay and it is planar so we can easily know that because one methyl group above the plane of the molecule and one methyl group below the plane of the molecule hence this 14 electronic system is in planar, planar structure and it has 14 electron and after giving two electrons by the potassium okay it, it is 16 electronic system 16 electronic system okay electron system so it is planar and by so applying uh, Huckel's uh, 4 and plus 2 system so we have 4 rings 4 into 4 plus 2 so 16 plus 2 it should be 18 electron to be aromatic but it has this system has only 16 electrons to satisfy this so we are applying only 4 in system so 4 into 4 so 16 so 4 in system and if the uh, molecule has planar structure then that is simply anti aromatic okay so this is anti aromatic structure it contains anti aromatic structure so from this we can give so first option is the right one for the given matchings okay if you like my videos please subscribe my channel thank you